Welcome back to Ride Madness, folks. I'm your host, James from Bourbon Social. In today's video, we are moving on to round three, the Ride Madness Final Four. In today's matchup, we have Hard Truth Sweet Mash Rye going head-to-head -head with Sagamore Spirit Double Oak Rye to find out which one of these bottles will be advancing to the championship round in Bourbon Social's 2024 Rye Madness. As always, before we get into the tournament, please hit that like button and make sure you subscribe to the Bourbon Social YouTube channel and help me reach my goal of 75 subscribers for the month of March. And now, let's get into the madness. Before we get into the tasting, I'd like to talk a little bit about each of these bottles. On my right, we have the Hard Truth Sweet Mash Rye coming in at 118.6 proof. On my left, we have the Sagamore Spirit Double Oak Rye coming in at 96.6 proof. The Hard Truth is a single barrel cash strength sweet mash rye, and the Sagamore Spirit is a blended straight rye with a double oak finish. The Hard Truth Sweet Mash Rye is distilled by Hard Truth Distilling Company in Indiana and has a mash bill of 94% rye, 6% malted barley. The Sagamore Spirit Double Oak Rye is also distilled in Indiana by MGP using their 95% high rye mash bill with a blend of Sagamore Spirit's 51% low rye mash bill. These two bottles of rye are both very different and they are both very good. However, only one can advance to the next round and there's only one way to find out which rye it will be. So let's get into it. As you can see, I have two all black Glen Karen glasses in front of me. My lovely assistant Lana poured a one ounce sample from each bottle into each glass, put the glasses on the wheel, gave the wheel a good spin. I do not know what's in each glass. I cannot see the color of each pour. So this is a true side by side blind comparison. I'm going to give the wheel a few additional spins. Whichever glass lands in front of me will be our first sample. Here we go. Okay, so this will be sample number one. Let's give it a swirl onto the nose. Okay, so on the nose, I'm already picking up aromas of toasted oak. It has a nutty profile. I get rye spice, I get cinnamon, a little bit of dark chocolate, some sweetness, it might be a little sweet fruit, a little bit of vanilla. Let's smell this a little more, see if we can identify any of the notes. Okay, so more of the same on the nose. Just the toasted oak profile. The same thing that you get with a toasted oak, a double oak, those notes of cinnamon, graham cracker, dark chocolate, sweet vanilla, toasted oak. Let's go in for our first sip. Cheers, everybody. So on the palate, I'm getting those same notes. The first flavor that I'm tasting is that sweet charred oak, some dark chocolate. It's got some sweetness, like a little bit of a sweet dried fruit, a graham cracker, cinnamon, no hug. No burn. I'm gathering this is a lower proof rye. It's just sweet, toasted. It has a very nice flavor. Let's have one more sip. It doesn't have a lot of proof. It has some sweetness to it. That toasted oak, some dark chocolate, some dried cherries, a little bit of vanilla, caramel, not much spice, a little bit of rye spice, a little bit of cinnamon. But man, I don't know how this advanced to this round but it's kind of disappointing let's smell this one more time we'll give it one more sip and then we'll move on to our second pour i clearly know what this is on the nose let's have one more sip and i know what this is on the palate this is a good pour but i think that sample number two is going to blow this out of the water let's get into it spin this around Sample number two. Let's give it a swirl onto the nose. Yeah. Come on. Night and day. This is jumping out of the glass at me. Super sweet. Sweet fruit. Mocha. Coffee. Nutmeg. That rye spice that's just got different flavor complexities. Oh, my God. This is a pour. Let's have our first sip. Cheers, everybody. This competition's over. I might as well call it a winner right now. Citrus, orange zest, mint. Wow. All I'm getting is just a creamy, rich, sweet citrus note. Let's have another sip. 
Let's see what else we can identify on the palate. This is a flavor bomb. I can't believe how citrusy and sweet this is. A very light oak, very mild char, just all around sweet and flavorful. Not a lot of complexity, but it has a nice mouthfeel to it. I'm going to do a side-by-side -side nosing and tasting. This smells nice. This smells phenomenal. Let's have one more sip of each, then we'll decide which one is our winner. Sample number one. Cheers. That's a great sip. That's really enjoyable. That's a smooth, easy-to-drink, flavorful rye. Nice little hug. Finally, finally starting to feel a little bit of a hug from that first sample. Not a lot. Kind of getting it right here. That could be because I'm drinking, you know, a full ounce of that. Almost a full ounce of this. But finally starting to get a little bit of a hug from one of these two pours. Let's finish sample number two. Cheers. Yeah, that, that higher proof, that sweetness, that citrus profile, that cinnamon and pepper on the tongue, a little bit of a richer mouthfeel, a nice warm hug, not overwhelming. In my opinion, if I had to guess, I'm going to say this sample is the Hard Truth Rye. One glass as an HT for Hard Truth, one glass as an SS for Sagamore Spirits Double Oak Rye. I'm just assuming with that high proof and that sweetness, and then that one had the toasted oak profile, it's, it's got to be safe to say that this is the Hard Truth. Let's find out. There you go. HT, Hard Truth Sweet Mash Rye, easily defeats Sagamore Spirit Double Oak Rye in the first bracket of the Final Four in Bourbon Social's 2024 Rye Madness. That'll do it for this bracket. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure you check out the next video where Van Winkle Family Reserve 13-Year Rye will be going head-to-head -head with Parker's Heritage 10-Year Rye to find out which one of those two bottles will be advancing to the championship round in Bourbon Social's 2024 Rye Madness. As always, make sure you like this post, subscribe to the Bourbon Social YouTube channel, drop a comment and let me know what you think of this bracket, and like I always say, life is better with a buzz. Cheers. Are you still here? Are you still watching? If so, the secret password is New England Clam Chatter. If you're a YouTube subscriber, drop a comment in the comment section of this YouTube video for a chance to win four two-ounce samples of anything on my collection, bourbon or rye. All you have to do is enter New England Clam Chatter under the comment section of this video for your chance to win. The winner will be announced after the final video. But don't tell anybody. The less people that know, the better your chances of winning. Plus, I want it to be a secret. I want to know who is watching to the very end. If it's you, New England Clam Chatter. Cheers.